If you've been doing searching for some wireless headphones and you're on a budget, these might be for you. Watch the video and find out for yourself. Hey guys, this is going to be a review of the Odium Wireless Sport Headphones, a $20 pair of headphones from Amazon.com that if you're on a budget, these headphones would be great for you. So as you can see, it comes with a nice carrying case. It's uh, obviously a, a fake carbon fiber, but it's a nice little material. So if you're bringing them in your bag, you throw them in here and it's, it's heavy duty so it won't get damaged. So inside are the headphones. A lot of these headphones nowadays, they all look very similar, whether they're the Beats, whether they're the $30 pair, the $40 pair. So guys, the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn them on by holding the power button. Uh, as you can see right here when you do that, the light starts to flash, which means they are on and they are ready to be paired. I'm gonna come over here to my phone, to my Bluetooth, which you can't see very well, but down here, the Odium Beats come up under other devices, and instantly, it's already connected. I know you can't see it, but it's instantly connected. I didn't do anything. Uh, it's just instantly connected to the- So let's get into the real part of the video now. Obviously, you guys came here because you're looking for a budget headphones that sound great and look good as well. So these are the Odium, the Odium wireless headphones on my ears. They're very streamlined, they feel good, they fit well. Honestly, they look like Beats, but I'm not comparing them to Beats because they are not in the same price range. This is 20 bucks, a brand new pair of Power Beats 3 is $200. For tenfold, this is an amazing deal and an amazing steal. But, of course, that's only if the sound quality is good on them. So, as I said before, it took less than three minutes to get this all hooked up, to get the Bluetooth hooked up to my phone, to the headphones, so now really what we're going to do, uh, I love Maroon 5, they just came out with a new song called Help Me Out, so I'm going to press play, listen to it, give you my honest review, and actually in a little bit I'm going to head to the gym here, so I'm going to give you another review when I get back of my full experience with these at the gym and how they actually worked out in real time. But for now, let's play this song and I'll tell you what it sounds like. Check the song out by the way, it's good. God. Need a metamorphosis. I don't know the words yet. It sounds very clear though. Very easy to use too. I can barely hear myself, so I don't know what I sound like right now, but these are very good at canceling noise for $20. The sound is very clear, very crisp. I can hear every word. I can hear the background music. The song has a little bit of bass. Uh, I'm not a huge bass guy, but the little bit of bass that is in the song is coming across very clearly. Okay. So far, yes. This is amazing steel, and this is why I got them. My buddy at the gym was like, yo, you need to get some wireless headphones. Because I had the Apple ones that were dangling down everywhere, and I was getting them stuck as I was doing reps. If I get this, the wireless headphones, I can have this in my pocket, I can have this on the floor, I can use my Apple Watch and pair it, and I don't have to worry about it because right here, this is the only cord they have is connect them together. So I'm gonna switch to a song with a little bit more bass, um, cause I don't know, you know, just to have a little bit uh, of diversity in, in the testing. So honestly, I'm gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna search on YouTube songs with deep bass, and it gave me the Panda song by Designer. Uh, but the deep bass version of it, so... I've heard the song, I listened to the radio, it's, it's okay. It's not my favorite music, but we'll see what it sounds like. I gotta wait for it to get through the beginning, the... I mean, it sounds good. Not, it's my favorite song, but it sounds good so far. Panda. Panda. Whoa! <laughs> oh my gosh! This is, <laughs> wow, okay, I'm gonna, okay, so I had no idea what to expect. Uh, right off the bat, right after the, the initial panda, it, it, it dropped the beat and the bass, it like, I felt it vibrating between my ears. I think my, it vibrated my brain. So again, I'm gonna play it again. I'm not a huge bass guy, but this has some serious bass on it for 20 bucks. I also do have, I'm taking this out so I can hear myself, I do have a pair of normal beats, uh, the solo beats, comparable, and I, 
I have no way, like, that's the wireless one, that's wired, but for 20, for $20, and this is so easy, like, if I'm after a set, I want to talk to somebody, just pop them out of my ear, drop them, listen to them, uh, you know, it, it takes, it takes a little bit of finagling to get in just because there's a little bit more to it than, like, you know, the classic ear pods that come with an iPhone, but... They go in nicely, they're easy to get in, you know, that the cord isn't big at all in the back, they look good, they're streamlined. You know, I didn't realize, but this is what people are wearing in the gym, they're not all wearing Beats, they're wearing knockoff brands, they're wearing Odium, there's a couple $30 pairs that I found as well, but like I said, I'm, I'm cheap, I'll probably throw these in my book bag going to, you know, going to the gym, and this is something, if they break, I mean, $20, it's not the end of the world, and I can get another pair. For $200, if I broke my, if I broke my headphones, I would probably cry. Uh, so, this, so far, is a steal with the sound quality. Uh, it says they last for about eight hours, which I have yet to experience. I, I finished the video up and I was gonna start mashing it all together, and I forgot the one thing about these is the is the battery, right? And that's something that you guys will have questions about, something I had a question about. After the first day and two of using it, I still have over half charge, and I was at the gym for maybe two to three hours each day uh, for various reasons, so I would say you're gonna have to charge these every two to four days depending on use. I really do think the eight hours is a very correct statement with these and how much they charge, but obviously over time you're gonna lose your power and you, you know your, your charge supply in headphones and with any battery in general. So these probably last about two to three to four days depending on use and yeah, I'm gonna flip it in there somewhere. I'm not sure where, but just so you guys know. But. I'm gonna head to the gym right now, get, I do a little bit of running at the gym, I do weightlifting, sometimes I play basketball, so I'll tell you guys how that sounds when I'm there, and again, I want this to be a concise review for you guys so you can make an informed decision if these are right for you, and so far, n no joke, 10 out of 10, I would recommend, I would buy them again, uh, but like I said, I want to try them out in you know real experience rather than sitting here at my at my breakfast table in my apartment, as you can see by all my my lovely laundry material here. But okay, I'm gonna be right back, and when I come back, I'll give you a full review. Bye. So I'm back from the gym, and this is my opinion on the headphones. But first, let me pull them out of my bag. One of the most convenient things about these was I could just throw them in my book bag in this little case, I don't have to worry about them being damaged, so that was super awesome. Uh, another thing I loved about them was the range. I believe that they are said to be up to 30 foot range, but when I was playing basketball, I was able to put my phone, because the main reason I wanted this, I didn't want something in my pocket, right? So I didn't want to have my phone in my pocket, I didn't want to have my iPod in my pocket, I wanted to be able to put these in, I wanted to have whatever the device is on the floor, away from me, on a bench, and I didn't want it in my pocket, that was the main thing. And with these, I was able to put them on the bench on one end of the court, and I could go across the other court to the other hoop, which I would say it was easily 50, 60, 70 feet away, and there was no breakage in the sound quality. It was still came through perfectly, there was no shortages, it, it was clear sound the whole way. If it's not a clear shot from the device to the headphone, then that's when some disconnect can begin. So when I walked behind a wall to go to get a drink, then I started to hear a little bit of that muffleness. But if it was a straight shot, it, it went far, maybe up to 50, 60, 70 feet, which was amazing. Also, the sound quality in these, superb. 20 bucks, you can't beat it. And I know that's the reason why you guys came here to see what the sound quality is like, and it was amazing. And that's the main reason you're looking for a headphone too. You're looking for comfortability, sound quality, and ease of use. It takes three minutes to set up, it was great sound, they feel good in the ear, they didn't fall out, I ran, I played basketball, I lifted, it worked for all three, and I believe that they'll work for you too. So I would check out the Amazon link, I'll put it down below, they were 20 bucks, and it's an amazing headphone! You can't go wrong, check them out, they look good, feel good, sound good, and your bank says it's good. So I would recommend them, and they get a thumbs up from me. 
So until next time, guys, I hope this helped. If you have any questions, ask below, and I'll respond as soon as possible. And of course, I'm going to give you guys one last look at what they, what they look like. I know looks are big to some people. Some people don't want to get the big, huge, almost earmuff look at headphones because they're too big, and it's all about the looks for them. Uh, these are very streamlined. They, they look very good. They look very clean. And yeah, so I just want to give you guys one last look at them before we go. The cord is almost invisible just behind your head. You can kind of pull them back, you can tie them, you can do whatever you want. I didn't notice them at all. They weren't in my way throughout my whole workout, throughout basketball or running, so it was amazing. And until next time, guys, peace! <laughs> at night, I think of you. I want to be my... Oh, I forgot I was recording, sorry. Okay. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, let's get to it.